Hi, my name is Alex Carlucci with Gustin Show Associates. I'm going to talk to you about um, high cost. A lot of you people don't understand this, neither do I. It doesn't make sense. I don't know why Congress hasn't changed it. But there's a thing called high cost that you guys call us and say, we want to buy a $60,000 house. And they say, I can't help you. It's too small a loan amount. What that rule and regulation was meant to do is to save people from getting ripped off on their purchases. So they create a percentage that your closing costs could not exceed the, um, the purchase price. So let's say you're buying a house, let's make it simple. Let's say you're buying a house for 60,000, 5% is $3,000. So you, all your costs cannot exceed $3,000. That's, that's impossible to do. The titles are $3,000 now, appraisal is $400, underwriting fee $1,000. There's so many costs that exceed that, that cause this thing to fail high cost. So when you hear a mortgage person saying, I can't do a loan that small, it's not because we're selfish and greedy and there's not enough money in it. There's actually a rule in place that blocks us from doing it. The only people that don't have this regulation are banks. So if you're a bank and you take deposits on a, uh, a customer, let's say you have deposits, you have a safe in the back, people come and withdraw and deposit money, they're not gonna have this regulation and they'll go down to around $25,000 loan. So that's probably the smallest loan you're gonna get from a bank is 25,000. There might be some rogue banks out there that do smaller loans, but in general, that's what a big bank's gonna do. Problem with the big banks is they're not as friendly as we are. They have too many overlays, too many high score requirements. So if you have questionable credit, if you're coming to GustinShow.com for help on a loan, I'm gonna recommend you go up to like 100,000 purchase or 90,000 purchase, because we're around 85 is our max loan amount. Uh, we find out that to be the rule, but there's no exact science on this. And at that point, you still need your closing costs credited to not count them against this formula, even though they are counted against this formula. It's really, really a messed up rule. And I can't tell someone for sure or not for sure, will 82,000 work or 92,000 work? Every loan's got its different little animal and some fail, some pass. So I'm gonna say around 85,000 is the, is, the, is the cutoff for the loan amount. And that's how high costs work. And that's you're gonna hear that from people if you're looking for low loan amounts. It's not because we're greedy. It's because the regulators stopped us from doing that. And they're, maybe they're forcing your hand to the banks. Maybe they want banks to make more money on those and let them do all the small loan amounts. But we can't do them by rule. It just doesn't, won't even go past into underwriting because it fails. There's a fail, a hard stop that says, can't do it. So that's the rule on that. If you got any more questions, give us a call or go to our website, Gustin Cho, G U S T A N C H O.com, or call me at 630 915 7550. We're going to probably talk you into know, raising your purchase price by. 30 or 40,000, it's gonna cost an extra $100 a month. That's why I recommend. Thank you very much.